Axel here, welcome back on my channel. Today we're doing a 13 photo cards video. This one is going to be quite short, com short compared to what I do usually because I don't have that many cards actually. Generally when I sort photo cards in my binders, uh, it's right after I received um, a Neo Q package, but this time it's not the case. I yeah, because I stopped for a while to save some money, so I didn't buy many cards there. And so, yeah, the next time I get one of those will be in over a month. I also, I also uh, want to film a video going through all of my binders. So, yeah, I wanted to put like everything that I had in there <laughs> before I filmed that. I have, uh, I don't have that many big things actually, it's just my from his nine um, album big inclusions that are there. This Yukika little film slip thing. And my cards. As you can see, there's really not that much. I'm going to sleeve those cards and then we will put everything in my binders. There's really not that much things. <laughs> I I guess if this clip is really too short, I will like wait and and combine it with something that I will do a bit later. But yeah, JWSN and Luna are coming back to back, and it's really like not convenient for me. So yeah. <laughs> Almost as soon as I'm done with JWSN, I will have to start like buying things from for Luna. Um, I will probably do not July but probably August. I will do like no K-pop <laughs> month where I will try to like save some money. We'll see. Um so today we are going to go only in two binders, my Luna binder and my girl group binder. So let's do girl groups first. So for girl groups, I have nothing for Etsy, all their cards that are on the way. Uh, I bought through Neokyo, so it will be over a month before I get anything. I did make a lot of progress on my KG collection, so I'm really happy about that. But then we have From East 9. A lot of older jewelry cards are bought on Neokyo, but we've got the cards for their latest comeback. So I joined the group order for their, for their comeback. Um, nine way ticket. I really, really loved We Go. It's one of my favorite songs this year, they really served. And so yeah, I joined a group order to try to get a Gyuris card. As you can see, I did get two of two of hers. And honestly, her cards are really similar. Like, you know, it's once again just slack poses changes. So I'm going to keep the other two cards that I got uh, through the group order, Serum and Soyon, and just do a page with these four. And because the group order was for a fun sign, it was 
Apple Music, yeah, it came with photocards, so I got Blu-rays and um, Nakyong. Really, really cute. We're going to. I made really a lot of progress on my from his collection, but it will be a while before. Uh, it's visible in my binders because I always say the most of them, them are at Neokyo or on the way to Neokyo. So yeah, I really, really love this card. It's I really like their little travel concept. I love the music video. It's really like fun and unique, you know. Their comeback did really well, and they were really close to a first win. Uh, it's a bit sad that they didn't get their first win, but I really hope next comeback they can. They really deserve it, you know. They've been working really hard for a long time, so yeah. From his dying world domination, please. Yeah, and uh, then I have the big inclusions. So the album came with those postcards. They're really cute. I I've seen some, some unboxings and there's the one thing that is like kind of a sad point is that they're not all from the same concept. So it doesn't really look cohesive if you collect a few members. Luckily the ones I got are you know both of the <laughs> mass concepts. So <laughs> So yeah, it fits well together. And then I've got these little like ID cards. I really like like how dedicated they were for, with the concept for this comeback. Even the albums are shaped like passports, you know. It's really really fun. I love it when companies are consistent like that and like try things for the packaging. These will probably look better if they were centered, but it's really hard to, you know, have both centered and look nice. So yeah, we're giving up. <laughs> And then we have Sarah today, and yeah, really exciting news, but I'm actually done with my Saturday collection! Once again, you cannot see it, and um, one of the cards I found is uh, on the way to Miyokyo, so yeah, it will be like over a month before I get this one. And I also bought the other one on eBay, so it's going to take quite a long time to get to me. But um, yeah, other than that, I'm all done. I also have a card that I bought from someone on Instagram that is on the way to me too. So yeah, hold on, let me check. Yeah, those are the video. It's all Bion cards that are missing. Um, I really like that one. For now, I'm going to put her here. And then, yeah, I'm complete with the DVD. The lighting is terrible, sorry, but uh, I'm going to get through the end soon. I really like this iron card, so I'm going to put it in the last page so I want it to do like this okay and since there's 10 cards in total, they don't all fit on a page, so I decided to put my two favorites on this page. And yeah. So 
So yeah, at the same time, now I'm ready for a Saturday comeback, but also, as I've mentioned, I'm in a crisis, so <laughs> I hope they can wait a bit. Because, well, since I collect 35, I will probably buy multiple copies, so yeah. Then we've got Yuki Kaka, so that's very exciting too, because... Yeah, with these three, now I'm finished with her collection. That's the blue card. How did I? Okay. I was lucky enough to find someone selling the Yukika cards I needed and her film thing also. Exactly the ones I needed, so I bought all those. I really like her cards. I've mentioned it before, but I was ready to collect like everything. I wish they did a bit more, like exclusive cards and everything. And yeah, now let's move on to Luna. So yeah, I some of you as some of you may know, originally what I planned was to collect like one card for all of their uh, pre debut release, but that didn't really work out well, so I kind of gave up because <laughs> I just never find the cards that I want at like reasonable price. So I saw this Asian one and it's really, really beautiful and I jumped on it. But yeah, it was a post that had a bunch of. Uh, Luna cards for sale and that was the last one that was available out of the five or six that I wanted and I jumped as soon as I saw the post so yeah hey this is editing Excel now um, basically at that part my neighbors starting to do a lot of noises so I couldn't film anymore so I paused and then it was night time I put away my Luna summer package card uh, on my own time a bit later because I didn't want to like wait or just film just that part you know so yeah sorry but let's move on to the next clip hey everyone so in this second part of my sorting for the cards in my binder video I have the a very random <laughs> assortment of things this is going to be mostly uh, me putting in my binder my uh, Luna Orbit Kit 3.0 things and also you may recognize the design but basically yes I bought this fucking thing the Fiesta D Day calendar for uh, that BTS released for June and you may be thinking like Axel you never buy like BTS things usually, but yeah, basically I was drunk and I opened the Weavers app and I was like, we let's buy this. And um, it's fucking huge. I have, it's very pretty, but it's fucking huge and I have no idea where to put it. And uh, so I deleted the Weavers app from my phone because I don't want to do stupid things again. At least it comes with a lot of photo cards. It's kind of a board game situation, so we've got those that are like basically game cards, I guess, to put in. As I've said, my Luna 3.0 cards. So we've got the whole set. We've got one Saturday card. I, I'm going to put it in. And then uh, two full sets of BTS cards. But those cards are really cute, so like, I'm not that mad, but yeah. And as you saw, we also have a few mistakes. <laughs> this is really like random, but basically I want to film a um, video showing my entire photocard collection this week and I want to have those in it. Let it like, yeah, let's sleeve all these baddies. <laughs>
so that's it for the reel for the guard I would say. And now dudes, <laughs> as you've seen, these are smaller than normal photo cards and I, yeah, that's going to look stupid in my binder, but well. I, I find it weird because all the things that came with uh, my D-Day calendar, the Everything always comes in the same order, and it's Namjoon, Yonggi, then Jin, then, you know, Obi, Jimin, and... So, why isn't, like, Namjoon, then Jin, then Yonggi? I don't understand. Is it always like that for their merch? As I've said, I don't buy those usually, so yeah. Okay, and then we have these. These are so tiny. I'll show them later, a bit later, when I put them in my album, but yeah. In my binder, sorry. Okay, let me clean everything guys. Okay, let's start with my one Julian card. <laughs> um, I'm going to jump directly to Saturday. So this is a Bianca card, one of the very few that I'm missing. Um, I'm going to put it here. So I'm only missing two cards. One I bought on eBay is on the way and the other is at Neokyo. So yeah, I don't know why I'm turning the pages. We are done with this. Okay, I actually have a few more things. So. The first round, and it's very exciting. It's the last fatal love card that I needed. Um, if you've seen my previous video, you know that I originally bought this card on Mercari and it wasn't actually in the package, so it got lost of something. And um, so, yeah, I found someone on Instagram that was selling me, so I grabbed it. Um, that's the page for their comeback. I don't have anything yet. But I do have some unit cards. I'm just putting this way. I need to find the other ones. And I was too fast. As you can see, I combined, <laughs> I combined a bunch of unit cards from different eras on one page because I, I'm not giving up on uh, collecting their unit cards, but it's a very low priority. So yeah, I know I. It will be a while before I get anything else. I have so much going on, and uh, right now there's Luna. I have to think about. Once I'm done with Owono and Shonu and Juwon, maybe I'll go back to this. Okay, now my boys. Um, with the Festa thing, I, I bought Young Forever and I pulled <laughs> this Namjoon again. I already put it in my binder, but yeah, we are going to 
go to the back and put everything here so that is the first set with like just d-day calendar written on the back this one is really really cute Obi doing this <laughs> this pose he's been doing it a lot on photo cards some of them have these little hard things but others don't but they all have the same like suit like kind of brown suit going on I'm just putting them in in a classic seven pattern way and I don't have like space fillers left so we leave that empty for now and then we have the second set so as you can see they are like in a more white outfit and they all <laughs> he's doing the same pose again. I love him so much. And they all have the green background, except the young was not like the other girls. His card is going to stand out so much from the others, but well. Okay, and then we have those. We've got those little ones which are game rules, I guess. Their picture is super tiny on that. And then we have those that are even smaller, but at least the picture is bigger. And I really like the flower thing. As you can see, it's way too small. I'm going to start with those. I'm going to push them to the back every time. Those things are going to move around a lot and it's going to be very annoying, but well. Now Jews, I'm going to push them in the corner every time and play. If I had like colored sleeves, this would be ideal. I'll see if I buy some one day. Ta-da! It's really sad because those are really really cute pictures. I really wish they made it like they made them like photo card sized. And now I hope you all are ready for some math because <laughs> we have all the other things and I need to figure out like what to put them in. First we've got this. It's not really something I would put usually in my binder, but yeah, I figured the, I figured this would like slip at the top of a two pocket. 
we've got those thin strips that are really really cute and if I had like yeah I know there are some kind of pages that could fit those really well but I don't have them I have these tickets <laughs> that I will fit in there and then a bunch of postcards I'm showing them to you real quick, but uh, yeah, we will try to organize all that. So let's try with a paper bag. It's way too small, and we should try with it like smaller. Okay, maybe I can put this like this. No, that's good. Okay, that's not too bad, not ideal, but not too bad, I guess. And I will use a three pocket for the two group ones. And I will put the ticket up here. It just fits like it's really really tight but yeah we love to see it so this is how it looks right now for the postcard okay we're going to do it like that they are covering each other but really the smallest bit And this unicorn, very cute. I don't show you all, but uh, group pictures are very. very... <laughs> Look at Omi, <laughs> we can barely see him. I think out of the film strips, this one is my favorite because they are like so random. <laughs> And then I really like how this looks. The, it feels like a, a nice full page, you know. Okay, and I just have three left. Sorry, John Cook, but you're. On your own. Tada! And I'm going to leave the top empty for now. Zbloop. This looks. Way better than I thought it would. That's it for this mess. Now let's go on. <laughs> Two things that I bought sober and intentionally. Okay, so I don't realize, but the gardeners are back outside, like cutting stuff and everything. So you probably hear them. I'm not sure. And, um,. This reminds me of a good news I have for everyone. <laughs> well, mostly for me, but my downstairs neighbor moved out. I know, I know. Now it's someone else that moved in, and uh, my life has been just so peaceful ever since. Life changing, honestly. And yeah, so. As I say, this is my Orbit 3.0 kit stuff and I am going to put this in this binder. Uh, spoiler for my photo card collection video, but basically now I have two Luna binders, which really isn't like unexpected because I <laughs> have so many Luna things and I collect so much stuff for them, so yeah, they really needed more space. The other binder has their 
like album cards and everything and this is really just the merch so we are going to first put the posters at the front I know that most people like put A4 things at the back and I may change my mind later but I like those you know they're like big pictures okay maybe I should put them after this but since it's new I want it at the front and then we have my photo card sets so night my special merch we're going to put the cards here before the bigger thing and this time we are going to do six and six because I'm going to put in my membership kit card uh, those are not in order so I'm going to do a classic two to two pattern nothing exceptional in debut order as I've said when I unbox when I unbox it this year Eugene card got tear I put it in the wrong way so here's Eugene then Miss Vivi and Miss Kimbe. I will put like fillers later, but once again, I don't have any, so yeah. Well, I do, but I don't remember <laughs> where they are. No, why is it? No, yes. Those cards are really really pretty and I like how like this and this kind of you know are the same outfit and everything and this one and this one like kind of call to each other too um then uh, we are going to put it here So those are like the message cards. Those are not in order again. And since Eugene was first and this is like kind of her concept, I'm going to put her here first. Oh, hold on. don't look like similar but at least now as still is with the other girls but then it's just debut order That's it for this sorting photo cards and other inclusions video. I, yeah, as I said, it's probably not the most interesting one that I've done, but all my money has been going to JWSN 
and Luna recently, so yeah. There wasn't much that I could do, but I still needed to put in the few things that arrived. I um, It's now time for lunch, so I'm going to eat. <laughs> but as always, thank you a lot for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!